we are presently uh, conducting a case study on uh, loss and damage due to adverse impacts of climate change in Bhutan. Uh, in Bhutan, most of the people are small-scale farmers uh, and changing rainfall patterns uh, directly like, affect the livelihood of majority of the population. We have conducted the field work in Punaka district, which is an important rice production area of Bhutan. We have used both the qualitative as well as quantitative method. Five persons have surveyed a total of 270 households. At the same time, three people conducted a wide range of expert interviews and group interviews. <coughs> <laughs> One of our preliminary findings is that almost all of the households reported that uh, rice production has been decreasing uh, in the last years due to scarcity of water in summer seasons. We identified several adaptation strategies in response to these changes. Farmers are, for example, increasingly maintaining their irrigation channels in order to make sure that no water is lost. This may mean an extra seven days of work per household per month. This obviously uh, means a huge time uh, investment uh, by the farmers. We also found out that uh, people living close to the river are increasingly using gasoline pumps to extract water. This uh, of course, is a very uh, effective way to reduce the uh, dependency on rainfall, uh, but implies a huge uh, increase in the production cost. Climate change is not something that exists only on paper. It is an actual threat for a country like Bhutan and we all need to do um, the best we can to help our people who are struggling with the real-life consequences on a day-to-day -day basis. <laughs>